So yeah, he threw out the DNA sample. Of course, it was my luck that he would clean the freezer of all days. Well, if your gut really says that you should check into things, I'm pretty sure the court has a copy of the paternity test results if you ever just wanted to make yourself feel better. No, but if you think about it, Gabby, there's no reason for me to even doubt we got the results. Like, it's from the courts. If I go to Joey and I'm like, hey, my gut says that the results are wrong, uh, maybe we should check with the courts and see their copy. He's not gonna, he's gonna fight with me and he's gonna say I'm causing problems. Yeah, I guess, you know, you want it to be something that it's not and you just have to accept what it is. But so what, you told him that you were gonna go to your mom's? You were gonna like leave? Yeah, I told him that I was gonna go to my mom's. But then I chickened out because he like smooth talked me into staying and told me that he's working on getting Chris out which I know he's just stalling. You know, I'm, I'm kind of glad this stuff is happening because it takes my mind off of the stalker. And I, I was just thinking that like, you really do need to get Chris to her family. It would benefit you so much. Why? Because I feel like given her record and given her circumstances and who she is and Joey's situation, I feel like if you give Chris to her father or her cousin or whoever, it's going to be impossible for her to get him back. And you won't have to worry about that baby anymore. It'll have its own life. And your situation will be fixed. I know. I'm hoping, even though it would entail Joey going to Texas by himself, I'm hoping the cousin thing works out. Um, they had said that they were gonna call me and I don't wanna be pushy and stuff. So I'm kind of just like waiting around, you know? I'm not holding my breath because someone taking a baby is, it's a circumstance that has a high chance of falling through, but I'm keeping my fingers crossed. The cousin, the, the one you said was Julia, right? Do you really think that she's capable of taking a baby on? And like, do you, if she took Chris, do you think she would like really fight to keep him? I looked at all their social media I listened to their brief story, what they told me and stuff. Didn't give me much detail, but it really sounds like this person wants a baby and has just had the worst luck in the world. And I, I honestly feel bad for them. I, I hope it works. Well, Miranda, I think you need to strike while the iron is hot. This is the perfect time, you know, this is it. You have to take this opportunity because you don't know what this situation is gonna turn into. I know, it's the perfect storm. With, if Chris goes to Texas, then Joey's, I know it's bad to say, but Joey would never see Chris and I wouldn't have to deal with him. And I know that's a horrible thing for the baby, but I think of it as the baby would have a way nicer life. And I mean, when it gets older, it would wonder about its dad and its mom, but for the rest of its life growing up, hopefully, it, would be, it wouldn't miss anything because it wouldn't know. Well, just like I've been praying that the stalker doesn't get me, I'll pray for you.